Ok, avant de vraiment de commencer, on va savoir si j'ai dit que ça crèche ou pas. Charlotte Bubule. Ah, oh, merci. Merci, merci. Ah, t'es à 3 centièmes. Eh, J'espère que ça va rester à 300 parce que... J'avais dit que je ferais de quoi 300, mais si ça descend en bas de 300, ça va pas se faire. Parce que je suis habitué que ça, oui, puis ça monte, oui, puis ça peut descendre. Donc, euh, donc si ça se maintient d'ici... Euh, d'ici mon spécial... Euh, je vais le faire, mais si ça descend en bas de 300, hein, ça va se faire plus tard. Jusqu'à temps que ça revient à 300. Donc on va essayer de voir. Non, ça va être correct, j'entends pas de grichement. Ok, il n'y a pas de grichement. Parfait. Ce que je ne veux pas que ça griche comme ça a fait dans la fois au tout début. Ok, ça on va fermer ça. Attends, non, on va fermer la plupart des trucs. Pour que ça me bouffe trop en bas de pensant. Pour pas que ça lag pour vous autres aussi. Ouais. On est prêt pour l'épisode 5. <rire> Donc merci euh, Charlotte Bubule. Merci, merci. Ça avance tranquillement, mais ça, ça augmente. C'est bizarre, ça n'a pas marqué sur les. Euh, sur mes trucs. <rire> Je vais peut-être la faire plus tard, ou. en tout cas. Parce que ça n'a pas upgradé euh, sur mes. Euh... Ok. <rire> la bataille pour le contrôle de Katam redouble d'intensité et atteint son point culminant lorsque Bruce découvre une nouvelle raison d'être et que Batman est poussé dans ses derniers retranchements dans son combat acharné pour rétablir l'ordre. Bon, ils vont un petit résumé comme d'habitude, s'ils le font comme d'habitude. Oui, c'est ça. Hein? Précédemment, dans l'épisode 4. It's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Why would my father have the Vales killed? I never said he killed the Vales. She was born in Arkham. Victoria Arkham. So where are you gonna go? I've got some other business I need to take care of. What the hell did you do? Our Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. That's what a leader does. <coughs> you don't understand, Batman. Without me, Gotham is doomed. Thank God he was finally stopped. Nice work, Batman. My job's not done yet. I still need to find Lady Arkham before it's too late. Bruce. All of your bat tech is linked to this computer. If you take it offline, I have to shut it down. It's 
série de jeux cette à beau choix que vous faites. L'histoire est déterminée par votre façon de jouer. Breaking news. The children of Arkham have taken hostages. High profile Gotham citizens, including Police Commissioner Peter Grogan, who was taken while attempting to intervene. I repeat, the children of Arkham have taken hostages. Carry on, Jen. Boss says it's time to get the bats' attention. Oh, la like pause, s'il te plaît. Hein. <rire> T'as quoi, elle est capable de se faire porter par le drone? Batman sighted, boss. Right on top! Ça peut s'arrêter de laguer, c'est plus à cause que je suis très mal à cette scène, quoi. city. Les cinématiques sont super bien, mais dans le jeu, je sais pas pourquoi ça lag. C'est ça qui va fonctionner. Alfred. <rire> oh, thank God. With the comms offline, I've no idea what's happening out there. I always fear the worst. I need to get back to the Batcave. Figure out Penguin's next move. I can't let him keep hurting. Ben, pousse ton anglais. What's your point? My point is, you're at the end of your rope. You can't even stop me off as a police commissioner. <laughs> Without your toys, you're nothing. Just turn yourself over to my men. Grogan's death is on you. 
Then I'm here to make sure you pay for oh, it. Oh, Batman. Those are just rules. Words can never hurt you. Unlike this drum here, which is designed to cause quite a bit of pain. Ta-ta, Batman! No, no, come on, just stay put. into it. I can get to Penguin. He's made improvements. Even deadlier than before. Wayne Tech. In Penguin's hands. It's a dangerous weapon. His men used a device that targeted my armor. If Penguin has more devices like that... The bat suit will be a liability. It's already in bad shape. It couldn't protect me from a knife, let alone Penguin's new arsenal. If Batman can't take the fight to Penguin, maybe Bruce Wayne can. Face Penguin as Bruce? Without your armor, you'll be more vulnerable. Penguin thinks he knows me, but he has no idea what I'm really capable of. He certainly doesn't. And that may be his undoing. Besides, I won't be going alone. Get Gordon on the line. Give him our files on Oswald Cobblepot. Tell him that we did a little digging after he took my position as CEO. He should know who really killed Commissioner Grogan. And that the killer will be in Cobblepot Park. Tell him that Bruce Wayne will meet him there. Lieutenant, these officers are at risk. Penguin is... Wayne, get back! Martinez! I saw... some kind of... transmitter... hidden behind the statue. Give us room. Transmitter? Wayne Tech. Controlling the drones. God damn it! Some of my officers are still in there. I'm not gonna let some two-fifth thief kill my men! If you can destroy the transmitter, Oswald loses control of the drones. There's no way to get to it. You heard Martinez. Lieutenant, you need a distraction. I can keep him talking while you get into position. How the hell are you gonna do that? I don't think listening to the guy who publicly attacked him is at the top of his priority list. I'm the last person Oswald will expect. I can use that. This isn't a gala, Mr. Wayne. Just making an appearance isn't gonna do jack all. Trust me, Lieutenant. I'm your best shot at getting those officers out alive. This is insane. But I'm all out of options. I'll go in around the back. If he sees me... He won't. I'll keep him focused on me. You will get your chance. Keep the perimeter tight. <coughs> if he suspects anything before those drones are offline, we're both dead. Same device that fried the suit. It's a hell of a trap, Oz.
J'ai pas d'armes, donc qu'est-ce qu'ils pourront en faire? Je <rire> suis pas armé. S'il y a un peu d'honneur. Euh... aren't coming back. They better not. Oh, oh. They say bad things about my family. I'll smash the dumb faces. Stop us, please. <laughs> I'll smash all the dumb faces. Get the word out, eh? All the channels. The penguins got a wane in Cobblepot Park. Oswald! Bruce! Welcome! The pigs are making it hard to bring in the bait for Batman. But now that you're here, I have the perfect lure! Not that I'm upset, but... What does bring you by? Mm -hmm. Never known a Wayne to stick his neck out. Come to talk, Oz. It's a bit late in the day for that. Still, I'm tough you popped by. Uh, so far, only Gotham's finest have bothered to show. They paid for sticking their snouts in where they don't belong. You know, I'm surprised Batman's not already here to save you. He's usually so on top of everything. Maybe you just aren't important enough. Everyone knows you're only Lady Arkham's head. Oh, nobody's lucky, Wayne! Lady Arkham and I are more partners in crime. And Batman will show. He just can't help himself when lives are at stake. And when he arrives, ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho! The lights, the sounds, the blood the gutters. Once he's out of the picture, there'll be nothing left in our way. Mine or Lady Arkham's. She's got some pretty big ideas for the city, and they're about to kick into gear. I know Lady Arkham's real name. She's Vicky Vale. Oh, did you figure that out when she stuck you with a needle full of drugs? You're done all right by all this brew, huh? It wasn't so long ago that you and me met in this very park. Me crawling out of the gutter. You looking down from on high. Take a gander at us now, eh? Night and day. You'd hardly recognize us, would you? I always treated you with respect, Oz. Respect? Oh, don't make me laugh. You only learned the word after I tossed you out of your company. some kind of plan, would it? You working with the bat? Did you really come here all alone, Bruce? If anyone could afford to keep that brute on the table, <coughs> it's you. Why, Oz? Are you scared of Batman? Might be, if I weren't so certain of my upper hand, as it were. Ah, not that you can't look after yourself. You certainly do know how to beat down an unarmed bat. I mean, the drug only reveals your true feelings. Felt like you were working out some issues there, eh, hey, Bruce? I am truly sorry for what happened, Oz. I never meant to hurt you so badly. I was drugged and... You? Pity me? I'm the one on top now, Bruce. And it's about bloody time. Your father locked my mum in Arkham Asylum to steal our fortune. He drove my own dad to suicide! The way it's caused the ruin of my entire bloody family. Enough of this! You try to get me all shaken up? I'm not waiting any longer. That man be dead. We're done, chap, no friend. 
I'm releasing these drones. You'll make mud out of you and all the lawmen around this park. All right, fine. It's my fault, Oz. What now? You're right. Everything that happened, everything you've gone through, that blame falls on me. On my whole family. How unlike you to admit your faults. Maybe you think that'll save you, eh? Ah, but guess what? It won't! Oh, yes! Bloody hell! is right. I gotta admit, you surprised me. You were right about this one. Gotham owes you a debt. The GCPD does too. I won't forget it. Let's settle for a beer. Yeah, I think we can make that happen. <laughs> you think this changes anything, do ya? Lady Arkham's gonna have your heads served up on a platter. He has a point. We just took down Lady Arkham's top man. She's not gonna stand for this. No, she isn't. I never thought I'd say this, but... I hope to God that Batman has a better idea of where she is than we do. Oh, but now I've taken control of Wayne Enterprise. Donc là, ça va être plus facile là, pour mes. Euh, pour ma technologie. Attends, mais attends, moi je mets un biscuit tant qu'il me donne le, le temps. Parce que j'ai mon petit dessin, mais. Mes quatre biscuits. Go the repairs. Going offline kept Penguin from finding the Batcave, but it also scrambled our system. The Bat computer barely runs, and worse, most of my tech isn't working. It's going to take time to get everything up and running again. If it gets running again, it's going to make tracking down Lady Arkham a hell of a lot harder. You've proven that you don't need armor or gadgets to help this city. In the end, Bruce Wayne was the one to stop Penguin. Oui, mais est-ce que c'était plus facile? Bruce, these last few weeks, I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. Not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted. And after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Always letting you down, even those whom you admire. Not everyone is like my father or Oswald. And what Harvey became, well, it wasn't by choice. And me. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it. If I'd done something all those years ago, this, this is my fault. All of it. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her, if I'd stopped Thomas, None of these horrors would have occurred. I don't blame you for what happened, Alfred. You did the best you could in an impossible situation. And it helped to make me the man I am today. I... 
Oh, salut maman, je veux qu'on avait dessus. But our work isn't done. Let's pass in bed, you need. Children of Arkham are still out there, and Lady Arkham. With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. I wish I had a scare. The only thing we do know is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. With Penguin gone and my CEO access restored, and finally log into Wayne Enterprises and see exactly what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. If I cross-reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale, we might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. Okay, so we'll look at those who are still alive. Damn it. Still offline. I need to get this working again. Hey, but they're making them. Damn it. I can't access the news feed. I need to get this working again. Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Let's see what Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. Master Cobblepot's sense of humor <laughs> hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just see what he was doing? Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is that any different than the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered? That's not. Unless. Hold on. Security. What do we have here? They did more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with a Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. If Oswald was the brawn, Vicky is the brains. So let's check her file. She may have left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. Oswald was, <laughs> was trying to buy an island. What on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. He was going to call it Falcone Island. <laughs> mm. We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Of course. Oh. Oswald certainly wasn't very frugal with my money. You have a few <laughs> yachts to return, it appears. Also explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using Wayne money to arm them. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne network. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in sociology. And my medical records. There are some, well, but colorful diseases. Annoying, but not hard to fix. Ah, oh, that's better. <laughs> well, no surprise here, Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. He was enrolled at Cambridge. Ridiculous. Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. All mention of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. I can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. One the bad computer can decode. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide?
Pourquoi il monte toujours comme ça C'est un dossier caché. Vicky Vale, mid-30s, reporter for the Gotham Gazette, and not in the public record, her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here, in the manor, she gave nothing away of her true nature then. Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on a twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not unlike Batman. I just need to find her. The children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to get justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. The Gazette's records are the articles written by Vicky Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries. But yet, it doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy to alter. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. Now that we know how Oswald manipulated Vicky's records, the back computer should be able to... There. No more holes. <laughs> she was looking into Arkham patients. Reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick, and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Gotham buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. You're on to something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside Wayne Enterprises, she can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Bruce, you there? It's urgent. One of the bad prototypes has been stolen. By Lady Arkham? Not quite. I'm patching you the feed now. She stole from you? After we opened our doors to her. After all that you two... Alfred. Yeah, I know, Bruce, but... Why would she do this? Is she that cold-hearted? That selfish? She must have her reasons. Well, I'm sure she does. The device she stole. It's a prototype. It's an electronic skeleton key. With it... You can bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands. Especially with Lady Arkham still at large. Get the car ready, Alfred. <laughs> I'm going to get some answers from Selena. Thank you. Do you thank you, Bruce? you thought I'd make it outside the city limits at least if you wanted to see me you could have just called <laughs> the chase is so much more fun but I know you're not here for me are you I don't blame you for wanting it back <laughs> I'm surprised you had a toy like this no doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, 
But the less noble options are so much more... exciting. Why should I give it back? So much potential. That device is far too dangerous to be out in the world. If Lady Arkham got a hold of it, that blood would be on your hands. Wow. That's pretty dramatic, Bruce. Catch. Nah. <laughs> you might be exaggerating, but I'd rather not take the chance. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce Wayne. Imagine my surprise when the rich playboy turned out to be Batman. Scourge of Gotham. You talk a good game, but... I don't buy it for a second. You're not that shallow. You really think you know me that well? I know that whatever this started as... That's not all it means to you now. The only thing it means... Is that I'm very good at my job. I'm getting out of here while the getting's good. Gotham's a house on fire. And I'm not gonna burn with it. If you were smart, you'd get out of here too. This town hates you. Hates your entire family. Just leave it all behind. Do something more... meaningful with those skills of yours. You don't need the money, but... But think of the fun. Someday, yeah. Maybe I will be able to leave Gotham. But for now, I am the only one who can save this city. So humble. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Harvey was out of control. And he wanted to destroy Gotham. If you did the same. And yes, I'd put you behind bars in a heartbeat. Looks like we're back where we started when we first met on that rooftop. Enemies. That's not what I want, Selina. I don't want to be enemies. <sighs> Look, Bruce. I'll admit that what you and I had... It wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. A more... intriguing job than I was expecting. But still a job. And that job's done. I'm done with you. It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. I'm a thief. That's all I am. I told you that from the start. I never pretended to be anything else. Stop. It's not true. I know there's more to you than that. You're just afraid to admit it. You'd like it if that were true, wouldn't you? Why would you even think that? I've made my feelings pretty clear. Why aren't you listening? Because I love you, Selena. You... You barely know me. Bruce, if that's your idea of love, I feel sorry for you. Well, there's one good thing to come out of this. Now I know I was right. You really are just like everyone else. Can't wait to get out of this place. Goodbye, Selena. Uh, check si t'as encore le passe-partout. On sait jamais. Lucius, I've got the key. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! I, I tried to keep them out, but... Alfred! De quoi? Alfred! De quoi? Dans le manoir?
Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. Just tell me how I can help. Get over here as fast as you can. I'm on my way. We're gonna find him, Bruce. I know. Need to focus. Figure out what happened here. What happened to you, Al? Ash everywhere. What did they do to you, Alfred? Something big was thrown against this wall. Or someone. Oh, euh, bonsoir ce qu'il y a, c'est bonsoir du monde. Euh, bonsoir à toi, Plumber. Euh, ah, ici. Petit zonier qui était... Je sais qu'elle a amené le gros colosse ou quoi? Furniture scattered outwards from a single point. Euh, ah, il y a de quoi ici aussi. A scuff mark. What could have caused this? The lock's been completely destroyed. Alfred must have barricaded himself in here. But they got in anyway. Oh, mais c'était bien barricadé. Ça dit soit c'est mettre la propre drogue de puissance, ou soit il était accompagné de quelqu'un. Blood pattern looks like it came off a high velocity hit. This pool cue was used as a weapon. Swung so hard it broke in half. Bon, c'est pas si difficile que ça à péter. Face was knocked over in the struggle. The fight left nothing untouched. Ok. Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. But it was knocked away. Must have used the concussion blast from her staff to try and stop Alfred. Just like on va assassiner Kid Bion with the table of Bion aussi. Alfred used the pool cue as a weapon, broke it across his attacker's head. When that didn't stop him, he used the jagged end to stab him, spraying blood across the pool table. I know what happened. The children of Arkham broke in. Alfred barricaded himself inside the parlor. He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon, before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. He broke it across one of their heads, then stabbed him to get away. Another assailant tackled Alfred, knocking over the vase. Alfred almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor, used her staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself. Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack. 
causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. He smashed his face into it. Oh, that's him. Wait. That picture doesn't belong there. Ich bin der Endbäufrin. Ich mag die Stelle von Bumacken. <lacht> He's making sure I see the reflection in his glasses. <laughs> he knows the back computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the reflection. <laughs> and I can view the virtual image using my cowl. <laughs> Good thinking, Alfred. Damn it. I can't access the news feed. I need to get this working again. Okay, Lucius. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Paint us a picture. Here we go. Okay, He's wounded. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Stairs leading up. Cement walls. We're in a basement. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. The camera. Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. Okay, looks like we've seen all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Quick and get on. Oh, yeah, trick you see. Rogers Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use their records to find home addresses for their clients. We're getting closer. Yeah, but we're not there yet. Let's get over. Ah, you did point. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Nothing else to see here. Moving on. Only one Masonic Lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. So the house was built in 1945 by them. That's a big lead. Yeah, because the old houses that are still there are not so numerous. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Jump to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Il y a la fenêtre ici qui peut dire ouais pour le basement window. What's that outside? Give me a second. They're by a bus stop. Ah go. ouais, le bus ça c'est encore bien parce que ça dit exactement où ce qui est le. Let's hope. Ah ça c'est un bon indice. Ça. Merci Alfred. Arrête d'autobus, ça serait plus facile à trouver. Get the bus line from this. 
but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Un dé de construction aussi, ça peut aider. Filtering for all homes built on that date. Ceux qui ont des sols aussi, ça peut aider. Pires, le journal. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. Donc on est trois U. On a le U ici, des derniers emplacements. Corner store. Seems unlikely. Bowling alley. Damn it. Let's keep looking. You are not going to believe this. What is it? Lady Arkham is back at the Vale House, <laughs> where she killed her foster parents. According to its records, it has a basement. We know where Alfred is, but I'm without a working bat suit. Actual. One of the early prototypes. It has basic cowl functionality, but outside of that, it doesn't protect much more than your identity, I'm afraid. Good call. Thank you, Lucius. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles, but it should still scare the crap out of criminals. Je remets un ancien costume. <laughs> This ends tonight. Oh, mais doit être plus là depuis un. Ça se remet à bouger là depuis. Heading into the basement. Be careful. <laughs> Batman! I'm all right. Right, it's in a bad place, but they're not there. No, Alfred. Damn it! There's blood on the walls. I'm going to see what I can find. Standing by. We the blood hasn't congealed yet. Means we can't be far behind them. <coughs> This is where they had Alfred. Oh, merci, me pour. The Raider, Ray, 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 J'ai fait que passer, je vais aller faire de douce. Ouais, ça va. Bonne nuit à toi, mais Et salut, euh, Washo. Ah, ça, je sais. <rire> toi, t'as un stream à faire, maman joue. Room. Ah, ça sent un fuit dans les dessous. With a hole in the floor. A rope ladder. Anyone down there would be trapped. Alfred! Inside. The boy, I've had même des coupes de ceinture. Je pense que c'était cette pièce. Down there, do you see Alfred? No. Some kind of torture chamber. 
shackles, belts, blood. What? Vicky, she was kept out here, locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? To willfully hurt a child? Vicky was just a child, and the veils locked her in the dark. Beat her. Revenge must seem like the only choice. Their own daughter! The Vale's foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. There are drawings. Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different, newer. Ça ressemble à... Attends, on va checker le sang, hein? This blood is fresher than the rest. Must be Alfred's. Toi, ça ressemble à poupée que... Ah, ça, c'est ses lunettes, ouais. Alfred's glasses. One piece apart from the others. Red. Maybe those towers that must be Arkham Asylum. Words, they're highlighted. Taking me. Vicky's own drawing of Arkham for the location. Arkham? But people would know. The staff would see them. That's the final piece. Arkham. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems. Including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors. Release the inmates. And she took Alfred with her. Call Gordon and the GCPD. Oh, I'm on it. Lady Arkham won't be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Appartement de Selina, ça ressemble à Arkham. That's the last of it, then. The children of Arkham have taken over. Lieutenant Gordon says the GCPD are on their way. He's leading the team himself. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Copy. On our way. Go ahead. I got this. This ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his payroll. Answer the question. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Another corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. He's done nothing to you. He's not part of this. Of course he's a part of this. He's the one man Bruce Wayne might actually care about. Besides himself, his suffering will teach Wayne a lesson. The one he and all of Gotham needs to learn. 
They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from me? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. <laughs> Too much to turn back now. I've been to your home. I've seen where the Bales kept you. People like them. They deserve to be behind bars. Behind bars? They deserved and got far worse than that. Even if they did, no one else needs to die. You're wrong! Your time's run out! True children of Arkham. These souls kept behind bars. Open the doors! Arkham! Listen to me! Freedom is yours! The only one standing your way is Batman. Batman. He stuck me in here! Me too. Ah, je pensais qu'il allait fermer un peu. of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went... Il n'y a pas fugé. Hein. Ah, il va vraiment figer de main. Attends, si je fais ça. Je vais pas recommencer. Pardon. Ah, tout pour me faire chier, quoi. Je vais pas avoir des épisodes de coupé. Hein. Là, c'est le dernier là, qui me fuck dans la face, cest -ce Ah, le Je suis obligé de relancer le jeu, donc je rien. 